The Senate has called on the Inspector General of Police and Police Service Commission to investigate the Taraba State Police Commissioner over the alleged abuse of human rights of 14 residents. The resolution followed deliberation on a motion by the Deputy Senate Minority Leader, Imano Pwacha, over the allegations of human rights abuses in the state. Pwacha says that 14 persons have been in detention beyond what the Constitution stipulates, even without a trial. Lawmakers noted that illegal detentions and abuse of power formed parts of reasons some Nigerians are against state police. Mr. President, the issue in question is a gross abuse of fundamental human rights of 14 of my constituents and the names are provided here with that. Mr. President, the alleged offense, though, being made against them was said to be criminal assault or criminal force and mischief, which actually was a quarrel between them or exchange of unpleasant words between them and a younger brother of my governor. Though the alleged offense being made against them are criminal, but are yet to be proven. It is common knowledge that the Nigerian constitution demands in the matter of this nature, the suspect shall be charged to court within 24 hours. A member of the same political party with the sitting governor in Taraba State, who has come to the floor of this Senate to allege that the reason 14 of his constituents have been detained illegally was because they were alleged to have, I mean, done something to the younger brother of the sitting governor, another PDP, you know, person. So we cannot sit here and say it is a PDP affair or it is because Taraba State is led by PDP. That's why this is a flagrant abuse of our constitution, of our law, and it must be addressed as so. These are issues that, as presented here, might require maybe further uh, investigation, if need be. But, Mr. President, distinguished colleagues, permit me to say also that if this is true, it clearly shows one of the reasons why some people are opposed to, for example, the idea of state police. We are a governor, we have unfettered power to do and undo. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.